Hello, I'm Evie Newsell, a cardiologist and an echocardiographer at the Massachusetts General Hospital. Hello, my name is Nathaniel Langer and I'm an adult cardiac surgeon and the surgical director of the Structural Heart Disease Program at the Massachusetts General Hospital. Hi, I'm Jonathan Passeri, a cardiologist and director of interventional echocardiography at Massachusetts General Hospital. It is my pleasure to invite you to join us for this year's continuing medical education course on contemporary practice in structural and valvular heart diseases, which will be held via live stream on September 9th and 10th, 2022. Through a collaboration between the Massachusetts General Hospital and Harvard Medical School, this accredited course will provide more than 18 credit hours of CME as well as maintenance of certification. Innovation in the evaluation and treatment of structural heart disease has revolutionized cardiology and cardiac surgery over the past 20 years, and the field continues to expand rapidly. This course will highlight the most recent evidence-based therapies for structural and valvular heart disease, review the newest transcatheter and surgical treatments, and discuss current controversies and areas of active research. And structural heart is no longer a synonym for transcatheter aortic valve replacement alone. During this course, you will learn about the newest options for patients who need mitral valve repair or replacement and tricuspid valve repair and replacement. And of course, we will review the most active areas of research for patients with aortic stenosis. The second day of the course includes an in-depth review of adult congenital heart disease and current state-of-the-art therapies for patients with septal defects, pulmonic valve disease, and aortic coarctation. Panel discussions throughout the course will provide you with a chance to discuss cases and controversies with leading figures in the field of structural and heart valve disease. If you would like more information or to register for the course, please visit the link shown below. If you have attended this course before, we look forward to seeing you again. If you are coming for the first time, we look forward to meeting you and to discussing this exciting area of cardiac care together.